Hello, we are happy to announce the launch of a new mini expedition soon. And in this video, we would like to focus on expedition bombs. Many of our players know that you can use bombs in expeditions to clear obstacles on the field. They are very efficient and can save you a lot of purple energy. That's why it's important to know how to use them. You can find bombs in the bottom left corner of the expedition screen. You can get them as a reward for completing expedition tasks and you can also purchase them in the event shop. The number next to the bomb indicates the number of bombs you currently have. Here is how to use them. You click on the bomb icon and a bomb becomes glued to your mouse. As you move your mouse, the bomb follows. Now you need to choose a place for the bomb. You can choose a place with several obstacles standing next to each other. For example, this one. To position the bomb, you need to click the mouse button on a free spot right next to the chosen obstacles. Please note that if you have clicked on the spot that is occupied by an obstacle, you will see a message can't be put here. It means that you cannot position your bomb on this spot and need to choose another spot. So I continue clicking the mouse button until I find a spot here. Here it is. Uh, you see the bomb is placed and some objects around it are flashing. A palm tree, an apple tree, dry grass here, three bushes and a pond. This flashing means that if you explode the bomb on this spot, these obstacles will be removed. Other objects which are situated around the bomb but are not flashing won't be removed. Once you have positioned the bomb, three buttons appear beneath it. The red button allows you to cancel the using of bomb. If you click on it, the bomb will disappear from the field. Let's give it a try. See, the bomb has disappeared. Please note that it has not been deducted. A bomb is deducted only after you exploded it. Now let's return the bomb to the spot. And the next button we see beneath it is the move tool. You know it from the main game and you can use it here exactly the same way. So if you have set the bomb considered the flashing obstacles and are not fully satisfied with what you have seen, you can move the bomb using this tool. For example, I wish to remove these two apple trees above the pond, but they are not flashing. So I click on the move tool and reposition my bomb closer to them. Like that. Now I'm happy and I can explode my bomb. To explode it, I click on the green tick. You see, the flashing objects have been removed and non-flashing ones remained. Please note that once you have clicked on the green tick, the bomb is deducted and this action cannot be reversed. You can also use a bomb to remove objects within a wider range. For example, if I put my bomb here, like that, the following objects will be removed. These two bushes 
three apple trees, a rock, and a tree with flowers. Let's see how it works. I click on the green tick to activate the bomb. See, these objects have been removed. So you can remove not only the obstacles that are close to the bomb, but also those that are further away. So this is how you can use expedition bombs. I hope this video was useful to you. Please follow the game news in our community and subscribe to our YouTube channel to get informed of our new videos. Thanks for watching. Have a nice day.